Now that we have this foundation, we've read all the letters of our own instruction book, we can start building on that, particularly in ways that benefit medicine. We can use it in ways that also help us understand how life works as a basic science kind of question. But for me as a physician, the part I'm most excited about is how we could use this to prevent, to diagnose, and to treat disease. And those things are happening rather quickly, building on that foundation of this instruction book sequence that we finally have. So we are able now to be able to look at that as a reference and then look at variations in the genome, that 0.1% of the DNA where people are different, and find where in that are the glitches that predispose people to diabetes or heart disease or cancer. And that gives us then a golden opportunity to be able to do better prevention and also to develop new treatments because we have a real light shining on causation that we didn't have before. So ultimately, over the course of 10 or 15 years, this is going to revolutionize the practice of medicine. I do think when people look back in a few hundred years and ask, what were the exciting things that happened about this time in history? The Human Genome Project will rank very high. It's probably the most significant organized scientific adventure that humankind has ever been on. And it's looking like it's turning out pretty well.